Never played this map. Do you see my? Do you see the screen, bro? You see this shit? Come play. Oh shit! Fuck. Bro. <laughs> I told you guys there's gonna be some VR content. There it is. I should stream it, bro. I should stream fr Five Nights at Freddy's. I just gotta figure out how to. Sh you don't even have to. I would just do it on YouTube since you already have a, a lot of subscribers. Yeah, I have Twitch. Twitch. My Twitch has like 3K. Uh, it's not, it's not. No, it is. No. 3K is sick, bro, for not streaming. <laughs> That's actually true. Yo, if you guys want me to stream some like fucking scary games, I might fuck up and say like the F word, as in like the homophobic one. If I get canceled and it's worth your guys' entertainment, it's okay. But yeah, welcome to another vid. Thanks, Madrid, for holding that shit. That shit's heavy, huh? Sure. Actually, yeah. Oh, yeah. uh, you guys remember last vid? Obviously, I bought a drone. The drone came and I got it, and it was really fun for a while. It lasted. Play the video while I was in here. Relax. Oh, oh, shit. oh, shit. <laughs> so, yeah, you guys saw that. I didn't break it inside, I actually broke it outside. So, yeah, the drone's broken, but literally, same day. I bought the insurance because you guys were saying, yo, get the warranty. I didn't end up getting the warranty. After 48 hours of activating the drone, you can get the warranty, which is like a cool little thing. I think they allow that because they're like, all right, once people get it in their hands, they realize how fucking hard it is. So then they go back and buy the warranty. But what happened was, is bro, I was going crazy, right? I was going crazy. I was flying it through here and then through here. So I was doing like this sick shot and then it would fly out to me out here. And I did it a couple of times, but then one time, the wind grabbed it, so I came through here and it went poof, straight into this wall right here and absolutely destroyed the thing. Yeah, we're waiting for a new drone. It was pretty sick. The only problem was I didn't put in the micro SD card, so all the footage, like I could watch back the footage, but I could only watch it on the drone, like the, the, the drone app. I couldn't actually download the footage because there was no SD card. So I literally had the footage of me flying into the wall. <laughs> but yeah, drone footage, we'll be back. Today, Weston and all of us are doing a big cheat meal. It's not really a cheat meal for me just because, you know, I'm eating comfortably at like three, 4K a day, whatever I want. So it's not really a cheat meal for me, but it's a cheat meal for Weston. We're gonna be training chest. I think with Jeremy, Marco, Weston. So it's gonna be quite the crowd. Also, you guys are probably wondering where Milo is. Milo is actually at daycare, so we gotta pick him up. I think what I'm gonna start doing, this is the first time I've done it. We knew that I wasn't, we knew that we weren't gonna be in the house that much this weekend, Sunday and today. I put him in daycare with where he usually goes to do my camera. My, fucking, my arm is sore from carrying this fucking camera. Where I, when we go on travel, we give him to that one girl. Her name is Lauren. She's super sweet. She's always got like 10 plus dogs there. So he's kind of made a relationship with them because he's been there probably two or three times. We go there. I drop him off for a day. It's like 50 bucks and he plays with all the dogs all day and she takes care of him. A little, little fun play date for him and a little where we don't have to worry about him being alone in the house for so long. So that's really good. What are we thinking, bro? Oh, do we? I can see where your goggles... Your where your goggles are, it's really nah, white. Bro, nah. I haven't tan in a while. I know we need a tan. No, I don't need a tan. I think you're supposed to like can't you just not wear the goggles and just close your eyes? Yeah, but it's still really bright. Like I tried that and it was fing burning my eyes. Okay. But what are you doing? What are we doing for cheat day, bro? Have you decided? No, I haven't decided yet. It'd be a, like a spur of the moment thing. Are you depleted? I probably am. Yeah. No, you're depleted as fuck, bro. Oh yeah, after the gym we should just go to five guys or go to Jupiter. Just right directly after the gym. I'm down. My vote is both. We hit Jupiter for chicken and waffles, and then we grab the sauce to go, and then we go to Five Guys and get the sauce, where we dip the fries with the sauce, and then the burger. There's a lot of options here. Yeah, we're not doing Cane's though. I definitely can't do both of those though. No, you can do both, bro. Guys, I have to show you this. We went to the store, and we were like, Fuck this bread, bro. bro. We were like, yo, 40 calorie bread. And like, this is real bread. You can see like, this is nice. This, this is not like some fiber, high fiber Pepper's shit. Farms. Yeah. So we're like 40 calorie slice. Bro, we're like, yo, this is the fucking gold mine, right? Bro, I pull that shit out and I'm like, no shot. What is that? <laughs> 
no shot, dude. Bro. It is the tiniest pieces. But I will say, I've been using it for my French toast, and it tastes good. It's not thick. It's not fluffy. I refuse to. It's good tasting bread, but it's not as big as like the other high fiber ones. They're like in 40 calories. I like Ezekiel bread. That's my go-to. No, the Ezekiel's fire. But I'm gonna show you guys my breakfast, bro, because I haven't done a breakfast haul. I haven't done, I haven't showed you guys my breakfast, so. But it's pretty much just two pieces of French toast. I've been doing, I mean, sometimes I do three, four, whatever I'm feeling. I'm gonna do two pieces of French toast with like 80 grams of egg whites. And then I do two whole Pepperidge Farm, pasture raised farm raised eggs. James put me on those because the yolk is like orange and tastes really good. I don't even use cinnamon in my French toast anymore. Literally just vanilla and a little bit of liquid stevia. Cause honestly the cinnamon kind of takes away from like that good eggy vanilla flavor. But look how thin this is. It doesn't soak it up much. But I will say it is damn delicious. Mmm, beautiful. Look at that. Put it all over there. Dude, so if you guys saw my Instagram story, started a um, my new, or like my, not my new, but my cycle is 400 test. It was 500, but I'm lowering it to 400. And it was 75 milligrams of Anadrol pre-workout, but I'm gonna lower it to 50 because my hair, I have noticed, has been um, coming out a little bit more. So I lower the test and lower the Anadrol. I do take finasteride and RU55, whatever the f the topical still i am getting a little bit of hair loss just a little bit extra than normal like usually everyone sheds a little bit like five ten hairs in the shower which is fine totally normal but lately it's just been a little bit more so i want to be you know cautious because i do like my hair especially because i finally found a haircut that actually looks good sick but i did want to say for some reason a lot of people have been asking like yo where's cal where's cal um i've made i talked about it to you guys on youtube before and i also did on instagram totally fine if you missed it might as well just say it cal is with avery and we're actually planning on doing a little bit of like a dog play date just to get milo and cal like reunited which will be really fun so cal's with avery everything is cool he's not dead he's not on the streets so just want to get that out of the way Look at that, bro. Insane flip. So we got two pieces of French toast, three whole eggs. And this is like kind of a lot. This is only 300 calories. Slap some sugar-free maple syrup on there. Also put this chipotle tabasco i put it on the eggs it's like a sweet and savory action you got going on so you take a bite of the eggs it's like really good and then you take a bite of the french toast with the syrup and you go back and forth a lot of people have been asking me this is almost like a haircut q a because i did get a haircut and i did not do a q a but a lot of people have been asking me what is anadrol like how does it feel so anadrol is a pro hormone i don't recommend any of it obviously but i don't recommend running it without a test space what i've noticed so far is it gives me a headache so there's definitely some blood pressure issues going on there pretty insane pumps and like when i drive like you guys heard of like the D-ball back pumps, but the Anadrol back pumps are just as bad. Like anytime I work chest or if I do back, my lower back is just fried. So I think from chest, because like when I'm benching, my back is arched, you know, it's tight. And so it just creates a, like a fucking heinous pump in my lower back. And then also when I drive, it kills. Gives me a little bit of a headache. But other than that, like the gains are sick. Strength gains are good. It's filling me out. It's filling me out like crazy. And it's only been like a week. It's honestly pretty similar to D-Ball. I've never tried D-Ball, but I've heard it's pretty similar to D-Ball. But personally, I just, I just realized this is shot in one over 60. Fuck me, first of all. And the exposure is super high. Guys, I just realized this whole thing was shot over one over 60, so that's why my hands were looking like that. But yeah, and I also lowered the exposure. Honestly, I'm more of a fan of Superdrawl. I feel like Superdrawl is, I don't get any hair loss from it. The only thing with Superdrawl is it's super toxic, so you can only take it for like two weeks. And versus Anadrol, you can kind of run a whole cycle. The pumps for both of them are pretty fucking insane. Honestly, I'm more of a fan of Superdrawl, but I'm gonna run the Anadrol cycle just because I wanna run a full cycle of it. So I'll probably do it for like eight weeks. Unless my hair really starts coming out and then I'm just gonna stop it. Probably go back to Superdrawl. Yeah, so the goal is I put it on my story the other day. I said, bro, I wanna be, I wanna try to get close to 250 pounds this year. Um, right now I'm 225, depending on like what I eat the day before, but I would say I'm 225 in the morning. Let me just show you guys. I'm not, like obviously I'm not lean. Um, I still get like striations in my chest and my shoulders just because I stay really lean up here. You know. I look at old photos and I see myself shredded. Bro, it's almost like a mental health. Like I hate to like bring mental health into this shit, but if you guys remember before, like way back before I even started my first bulk, I was really insecure about being getting fat. So I didn't, I never wanted to get fat, but now I've kind of like accepted the fact that like I had my rebound or I didn't rebound. I had my, my binge fest and I put on a lot of fat and that was my fault, but I've become more accepting over it. 
And now I'm like kind of just fully committed to this bulk and I want to get fucking huge and then I want to cut down and then I would like, I'll get really shredded and then hopefully I can do a proper reverse and then actually be at a body composition that I can maintain for a few, at least a few years, you know? So right now 400 tests, 50 milligrams Anadrol. Gonna see what I can do with that. That's the update. Just want to talk to you guys for a little bit. Gonna eat my food. See you guys when we go to the gym. All right, little change of plans. We're gonna go pick up Milo now. now. That way we don't have to go to the sitter at like 9, 10 p.m. while she's about to go sleeping because that's probably disrespectful. So we're gonna go pick up him now as well. Also, look at the jacket. This just dropped with Young LA. This is like 49 bucks, I think, with a code. Look how quality it is. And it's cold. It's cold here, so it's really warm. It keeps your neck warm. You can see the fur. It reminds me of the villain in Spider-Man Homecoming where he's like flying around with the wings. You guys know what I'm talking about, bro? Put up a picture, man. The villain in Spider-Man Homecoming with like that shit. Or it reminds me of Bane, cause Bane would wear one like this with the fur, with like white fur. You know what I'm talking about? I've never seen no. you never seen Batman? Fucking uh, Dark Knight, Ri not Rises. Batman Return, I don't know which one it is. Which one is it with Bane? Sorry guys. All right, we'll be back. Mmm, yummy. We got Milo. You wanna go outside? Yeah. You guys wanna see some speed on Milo? Good boy. Bring it here. Give me ball. Good boy. Eh, give me ball. Give me ball. Mm -hmm. Good boy. Oh my. I've never seen him do that. Sit. <coughs> sit. Milo, sit. <coughs> Lay down. <coughs> Lay down. Lay down. Okay. All right, we got the pre-workout meal going down. Classic cream of rice. I actually threw a little bit of egg whites in here, which makes it like a little bit more fluffy. And then I put almond butter, a uh, little bit of cinnamon and some maple syrup. Do you gotta just at least try the egg white way? Cause you don't cook the egg whites, right? You microwave them. Okay. So they I get cooked to... and they create like a, like a fluff. I'm just not a fan of- And a little extra protein, bro. I'm not a fan of carton egg whites. A little, fat, little extra protein. You don't even taste it though. No, I'm not. It's not the taste. It's like what it does to my stomach. Yeah, that's crazy, bro. Your upper chest looks insane. Does it? Really? Yeah. Is it really? <laughs> wait, wait, wait. This way? No, other way. No, just look more towards me. Uh, yeah, yeah. Nah, dude, that actually looks nuts. It's Mr. Germ. Get out of the car. 3D. You getting a 3D? Yeah, I need one. Man. I need it for my, my health, my mental health. I will not be having a 3D. Well, yeah, you shouldn't. <laughs> <laughs> bro, how does Marco get this reserve spot, bro? Weston, how does Marco get that reserve spot? He's a knockout top athlete. I wanna be, I wanna have reserve spot. If he can have reserve spot, I can. Which one you going with, bro? I'm gonna go back to my roots. You got that last time. No, I got this one last time. Well, I got th this last time, I can't. Oh, remember. oh. Try a different one, try a different color. Just be adventurous. I'll do this one. Orange? Like orange, right? I like orange. You going to, you going to um, Jupiter? Yeah, bro. Chicken and waffles. Chicken and waffles, bro. Bro, the the mastermind's getting to you. Bro, chill. chill. Your hairline's <laughs> fucked. It always looked like this. Nah. Don't fuck. Nah, me. nah. I'm putting the beanie back on. Dude, we're we're fucking rolling deep today. We got four people. Yeah, this is definitely going back on. Thank you so much oh, for the new family. I was kidding, bro. I was kidding. My hair is always No, my hair is actually falling out. I lowered the Android really? and lowered the test because my hair is falling out. Really? Yeah. It low-key looks thinner. No, I don't think it looks thinner. Well, it feels thinner. So, <laughs> like, look. There's one hair right there. Bro, I'm so white. I look like a fucking... I look like I belong in, like, Chernobyl. Start tanning, bro. What is your problem? Let's go tomorrow. Let's You're go tomorrow. I actually have to. Let's go. You can take you this have little chub. There? You can pin me in my chub. And right. then we'll okay. go tan. Dude, yeah, no, he's, Can I? he was up for like seven. You just hit a lift? I did squat and bench press. Damn. I'm doing powerlifting shit I was about now, to say bro. power lifter, bro. Yeah. Fuck. I hate my physique, so now I gotta focus on getting strong so I don't think about my physique because I'm, I'm fat. I'm turning into a bodybuilder, bro. I'm committing to the bulk. Never thought I'd see the no day. No more trend. No more recomp. No more recomp. <laughs> it's fully bulk time. I want to be 250. Good shit, man. That's going to be epic. I want to be 250 with a lean face. Warm it up, it's so loud. Alright, in honor of 
of uh, Yeet. Pretty good song on his Instagram. He deleted it though, so in honor of that, we're gonna play some Yeet today, like we always do, but we're just gonna play some Yeet. There's four people here. Hopefully we can actually get a efficient workout with four people. I usually don't like training with four, but you know, today's an exception. Perhaps. Look at him, bro. Are you big? Maybe a little bit. Oh, okay. I'm just making sure. <laughs> Why? I don't know. Uh, I look like I'm swimming in it, right? No, I was just making sure. I feel so small. I was your weight, and now I'm like 25 pounds less. I'm literally trying to hit 250, bro. You, honestly, it would fit his frame. Yeah. I probably got two pounds in my hamstrings, two pounds in the calves, one pound each, five in the chest and shoulders. And then you gotta think, the more muscle you have, the more fat you can have at the same body fat percentage. Oh yeah, that's actually true. So you could gain five pounds of fat if you gain 10 pounds of muscle, it'll be the same body fat percentage. I'll look the same. No, you'll look bigger, but the same body fat composition. And I'll have better fat distribution. Yeah, you will. I bet they weren't expecting to learn today, exactly. bro. They're learning bigger, right now. Yeah, you guys, never, you guys never learn in our videos. <laughs> but the bigger you are, the more fat you can have and still look that's shredded. That's true, that's actually true. I'm just gonna up the growth hormone. I'm gonna do like 10 IUs. <laughs> I'm gonna do 20 IUs the Rich Piano way. I have, I have BB Pro. I'll be going through a kit of growth every day. Where are we going? Piano. What's next? Incline? Or are we doing. I'm down to incline. Psycho. Big fucking milkers. 250, baby. Give me 250. Give me that shit. Yep. Yep. Wait, Weston, what's your weight? 175. I'm 50 pounds heavier than you. Oh. I'm fat as f bro. <laughs> 50 pounds. Bro, these fucking guys, they're making it really hard for me, bro. Like, as soon as I, like, start the bulk, or as soon as I commit to the bulk, they're fucking dice to the, to the gills, but... When I cut, they'll be like rebounding and shit, so they'll be like, they'll be binging while I'm like shredded. Playing the long game. Yeah, I'm playing the long game. But really, they're playing the long game because then when I re reverse, they're gonna be cutting but again. But then you're playing the longer game because yeah, I'm going again after them, so it's just an endless long game. He's not, he's barely lifting. Look, my tank's like soaked. His looks like he just got out of the dryer. Bro, look at my chest right now, Kenny. Zoom in on that shit. That's at 20% body fat. 20% fucking veins and striations. Give me. Guys, it's not very basic, they can't hear you, guys, we're vaxxed. <laughs> They're making us wear masks. The virus going around, it's no joke, okay? Yo, I'll go. It's like Ma yeah, mask up, guys. Wear your mask, okay? Oh, no, they're leaving. No, yeah, they're leaving. They were like, the Alpha Lee workers came over here, and they are like, okay, Sush is wearing his mask. They're good. So I think we're good. I can take it off now. Oh, I'm refreshed, but I'm I'm exposed. I feel like I, I feel naked. Hey, you're pretty sick, bro. I know. <laughs> Thanks, bro. Yeah, bro. Yeah. Shut up. I'm ruining my video, bro. Dude, I'm gonna kiss you on the lips. 
that was the workout. Honestly, like for four people, or, like we actually had a pretty, I, I mean, I had a good workout. workout. Yeah, you worked out alone. Yeah. Like, I actually had a really good workout, so we're gonna go to Jupiter, chicken and waffles, sweet potato fries, gonna eat up. I'm bringing you guys, obviously. Pretty sure everyone's pulling up, so it's gonna be sick. Yo, call them right now, bro. Call them right now. It says close. It says close. Okay, it's moment of truth. Moment of truth. Punch speaker. Punch speaker. Punch speaker. Bro. Say Martin Luther King Day. Oh, Martin Luther King Day. <laughs> You're racist. You're racist. No, bro. but like. That's racist. Bro, I had to go to school. You're going to close chicken and waffles? That's fed up. This is what I mean. Bro, like, I'm down to wait till Damn, no. I'm waiting till tomorrow. No. No, I no. can't. I'm not we, wasting bro. it on some I'm whack so ass cheat, bro. I've been looking five guys, bro. Ass, five guys are sucking up. Yeah, let's do a crazy ass five guys day there. Bro. I'm down like to go wherever. Butter but milkshake. Five guys. Honestly, a peanut eat. butter milkshake. He just said he's not eating, and if he's not eating, we're not nah, going. I'll still go. Jupiter is closed because Weston didn't want to go for breakfast. What a fucking sad ending to, so to my sad. to my video, bro. All right, guys. So Jupy. Old Jupy is closed. Pretty upset. We're gonna go tomorrow. Well, at least at least you can throw it in your vlog. Yeah, I guess. Yeah. So Wes, if you guys want to see us, well, not All eat, right. but like we'll go to there. You guys can look at the chicken and waffles tomorrow. But I'm sorry, you guys could not see us indulge on some good food. Everyone, in down in the comments, make sure you thank Kenny for filming. And we made him stay longer, even though we're not even getting any food. Honestly, I'm gonna get Chick Fil A. That's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna get Chick Fil A. But I did my good deed for the day. Um, if you're watching this, I didn't catch your guys' names. So you need it to be 18 to, to be able to get into Alphaland if you're doing a day pass, if you don't have a guard. Or you need to be 18 to get in, and if you're under 18, you need a 21-year-old. Right, you need 21-year-old guardian or relative. These guys, like, they, they came up to us, they were taking photos with us, and then they went in, and then we saw them come out, and they were all sad. Like, they had their heads down. I was like, yo, what happened? They were like, not, we're like only three of us are, like, only th three of us couldn't get in. And I was like, bro, I got y'all. Because they were 17. Yeah, because they were 17. And I was like, I got y'all. So I went in there, and I was like, yo, these are my homies. I'm gonna be their guardian, so I signed off for them. So if you're if you're watching this video, comment down below so I can just be like, how was your lift? Because we're about to leave and you're lifting right now. But that was my good deed. So if you guys are ever trying to get into Outland, just you know, hit the boy up on the plug. <laughs> Don't tell CG. What a nice guy. Yeah, I'm a nice guy. That's my good deed for today. I'm gonna get Chick Fil A. He's probably gonna eat beef and rice, bro. Yeah. So we'll see you guys in the next one. Thank you, Madrid. You know, thank you, Kenny. Thank you, Weston, for working out and holding me hammering out. I was eating Weston, bro. <laughs>